If this capsule history of our progress teaches us anything, it is that man in his quest for knowledge and progress is determined and cannot be deterred. The exploration of space will go ahead, whether we join in it or not. And it is one of the great adventures of all time. And no nation which expects to be the leader of other nations can expect to stay behind in this race for space. At one point, space was a benign domain, but through the years our near-peer competitors have advanced dramatically and quickly to where now we live in a world where the domain has become contested, congested, and competitive. Daily life and those things we rely on, which most Americans take for granted, are now being put at risk. Like any other military branch of service under the Department of Defense, we are tasked with organizing, training, and equipping forces. For the Space Force, we organize, train, and equip guardians that conduct global space operations that enhance the way our joint and coalition forces fight, while also offering decision makers military options to achieve national objectives. We protect the interests of the United States in space, we deter aggression in, from, and to space, and we conduct space operations. We're in a better position, but a different place. We have to build the shared future that we seek. A future where nations are free from coercion or dominance by more powerful states. Where the global commons, the seas, the air, and space remain open and accessible for the benefit of all. The United States Space Force ensures that it remains open and accessible for all. I could provide you with a litany of ways that you're using space every day, but I'll limit it to just a few common ways. The phone that most of you, if not all, are carrying with you, which provides you your time and connectivity and access to your whole world, goes through space. The Sirius radio in your car and the direct TV you watch at night all go through satellites in space. The ability to find your way from point A to point B utilizes the global positioning satellite, which is on orbit in space. And what many people don't understand is that GPS also provides the highly accurate timing which runs our ATMs and drives our economy. Without space, Americans would be lost.